is going on, guys? So, uh, this is my first workout after a, a really big scare that happened um, the previous Friday. So, this particular workout is on um, the 30th of June. And uh, that Friday, I uh, <laughs> the ironic thing... As I mentioned in the video before, I'm, I'm, I was doing um, stability work and core work to uh, to kind of um, get healthier overall and, and fix my imbalances. And in between that, somehow I uh, I kind of got hurt. But I believe again it was something that was built up over time. But I literally could not walk on Friday, and this is the following Tuesday. Uh, or sorry, I could. I could not walk for uh, more than a few steps without getting winded and feeling like I'm going to collapse. But this is the following Tuesday, and uh, basically I, I kind of went back to some some of my roots and uh, did an old school uh, bro workout. This workout took no more than uh, I would say a total of 45 minutes with stretching and um, doing some foam rolling and mobility in the beginning, but. Uh, basically, I got this from um, an old generic uh, system or program that I found on bodybuilding.com a long time ago from Chris Gethin, which is actually the first like full program that I've stuck with um, and the most consistent I stuck with. But anyway, what the program entails is uh, 50 reps. You start with 50 reps at a light weight and then start, slowly start increasing the weight. So you go 50 reps, 40 30, 20, 10, then you go 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. So what you're doing is increasing the weights as the reps go down and decreasing the weights as you pyramid back up in reps. Now, uh, as you've watched, or if you've watched uh, some previous videos, I, I do stick, uh, I'm pretty OCD about like programming or as far as staying consistent to a, a plan, I guess you could say, not necessarily programming. But uh, again, this was my first day back. I didn't want to do anything. My back is still extremely tight. I actually went to go visit the chiropractor after this for the first time and it felt great. Um, but, you know, in the, on the internet nowadays or on uh, social media in general, um, Bro, uh, bro workouts or, or bodybuilding type style workouts or really high rep workouts get such a bad rap. And, you know, it's usually from people that have never tried um, really high volume or high intensity. Or if they have, their, their form is just terrible. Um, I'm not saying I have the best form. Uh, and I'm not stating that at all, but I would say... I have a uh, better form than most or most people that um, would, uh, for lack of a better word, ridicule this style of a, of a workout. So my suggestion would be if, uh, if you have not tried high reps or, or high volume, uh, try it for, you know, a good 8 to 12 weeks and see what kind of a difference it's made on your uh, body composition. I know it made a huge difference for me. Of, uh, I still include it even in, um, even when I was doing, when I was and am doing uh, powerlifting routines uh, as my accessories. Like I try to keep things uh, fairly high volume. Um, now, am I going to do something like this every single time or every week, like 50 reps, 40, 30, 20, 10, and, and backwards? Probably not. Uh, that's probably going to be a little overkill on my body because I'm not going to eat enough nutrients to, uh, to recover fast enough. But give it a try, guys. Like, before you start you know, looking down upon this or saying, oh, that's a non, not natty workout or whatnot. Like, try it out as a natty. and It worked for me. And, uh, you know, just try it out. See see how it helps. See how it helps you. And if it doesn't, then it doesn't. Uh, but at least try it out before you just spew off some nonsense that you just uh, 
just happen to follow. Don't be a sheep. <laughs> Go do the workout. Anyways, guys, Fatty Mancy checking out, and I'll see you on the next video. Peace.